Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Guy News. I'm Dvorak, and this is going to be a quick couple-minute video on the Nationals inking our former friend here in Philadelphia, Cesar Hernandez, to a one-year, four million bucks deal. As Cesar normally, obviously, is in the 270s in his career when it comes to hitting, but last year, um, really kind of emerged, showing the power numbers, um, with 21 home runs and only a 232 average. Before his career, he's typically been a very solid fielder at second base, a guy that can obviously run on the bases, doesn't steal as much as people ever hoped he would be able to, but can have a good instinct running on the bases, and also good speed to be able to get from first to third, first to home, and always guarantee him pretty much second to home. So, those are good things to have. In his career, he's 270 with 70 home runs. And also 1,005 hits, so he's over that career 1,000 hit threshold, which is of course a great accomplishment to have. He's a 270 career hitter and has 335 RBIs and nine years service, so he's only one year away from getting the full MLB pension, which he's certainly going to get, I would certainly believe. So Cesar is back in our division. I have a feeling, just like a lot of former players for the Phillies, he's going to end up being a guy that destroys us when we play him, unfortunately. He's a guy that's going to get featured into that Nationals lineup now and be able to play consistently for them. And obviously not against us. I wish him all the success uh, there in D.C. against us. Hopefully we're able to get him out and he won't be like those former players that end up torturing the Phillies. But hats off to him to be able to get another one-year contract for a team that obviously has won the World Series, then wasn't good, but, you know, who knows um, for the Washington Nationals. You never know. Teams have bounced back before. Look what the Red Sox did this year after being off last season. So you never know. They add Cesar Hernandez, who is a very solid, consistent, steady Eddie second baseman. Nothing special, nothing overly sexy, but you just kind of know what you're getting from him. And it seems like as he's aging, um, he's developing a little bit more power since he hit 21 home runs last season um, in a year after he only hit 14 home runs in the last full season, so if he's developing that more 15 to 20 power, and even if he doesn't have as much of an average, average isn't his weight in today's game, obviously, I don't know if I 100% always agree with that, but it ain't, but he always successfully has hit in his career 270, not that 230 with power, so if he can hit more like 250 something, but have the 20 home runs, I think the Nationals would obviously really love that output, even if he hits the 270 and did what he did here in Philadelphia, then I think they will still really enjoy that as well. But this has been a short video on Cesar Hernandez coming back in our division. If you enjoy the content, please consider subscribing. A special thanks to the 168 that have this far, and I hope you're all having a great holiday season. Peace out, everybody, and stay safe and have a great, safe week. And hopefully our Philadelphia Phillies start making some bigger moves. But stay safe out there, and peace.